<laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, good morning. Now, uh, what are we doing? We are listening to some Disney songs because they're very good to connect you again with the world. <laughs> oh, people, my head is trying to hurt today. I don't know why. Feels like I'm, I've been working hard for the past two weeks for some weird reason. I haven't, honestly. I don't know why. Oh, but I, uh, I just found one of the. Did you do know that uh, in the Tolkien's universe, the Lord of the Rings, Hobbits, and stuff like that, everything talks, and everybody sings, and he wrote hundreds. Well, I don't know how many, but a lot of uh, songs and poems into the universe. And right now, I just found one of the dwarf um, poems, "King Beneath the Mountain," the King Beneath the Mountain, the King of Carven Stone. The Lord of Silver Fountains shall come to his own. His crown shall be upholden, his harp shall be restrung. His hall shall echo golden from your songs restrung. And the song, what? The wood shall wave in mountains on the grass beneath the sun and well fall the mountains. When the river is golden run, the streams shall run in gladness, the lakes shall shine and burn, all sorrow, fail and sadness, at the mountain king's return. Very interesting. And that thing made me think about something. I opened my book, I took my book out of the trunk of the car and uh, there is a dragon that talks in my head. Alright, everybody says it's dead, but I can tell you, I have seen worse. Look at that. That is the plan that I'm taking care of. And I can tell you, ask my mother. She can tell you that she cannot take care of Uh, happy holidays is right. just a gift. <laughs> and uh, See, because you're our gift. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a gift. Decorated the uh, like napkins. Oh my goodness. These are posters, right? Uh, yeah. I don't know. I don't know. The little plates. For small meals. <laughs> for big people. <laughs> but pretty much that's uh, if you come to Bulgaria, that's what you come, you go with. Nope. And, little, and what I do with the rose oil? Do whatever you want. You can put it on you. You can. It says perfume. That's great. Not? I think I can find a recipe because I think that might be a concentrate. You can open it and uh, it might be a concentrate. You can. Uh, I know a little recipe for making a, a small perfume with a concentrate. Yeah. It's um, this much drops of oil to this much amount of water and a concentrate, and you can make an actual perfume that stays on you for a long time. With these modest gifts, oh, we want to express our gratitude for your intimate has done for our son. We wish you good health and happy days. Thanks again for taking care of our family and the love. Thank you. That is so cool. He takes care of himself, eh? Yeah. He's just a pain in the butt. He may not be our blood son, but he's next to that. He's our heart son. Oh! Oh, how neat! He tore I asked a bunch of questions. Oh! History and culture, there we go. I might learn something about my country too. Potpourri, huh? They loved it. Whatever my mom and my family sent it to my Texas, I don't know, host. <laughs> Uh, they loved it. Right now they took the whole box and they went um, into the hangar to show it to Roger and Judy. And I'm, I said that I'm gonna make some coffee, because it's just about time for more coffee. And I'll come answer the questions. It's, it was wonderful.
coffee. Son of the Lone Star State of Texas, through and through. And we know how to settle scores down there. If you doubt me, that's Mexico. Hot girl, nine o'clock. Oh, ladies and gentlemen, the raw and sorrow feel of an end. When the adventure is done, when the chapter has ended, when the fellowship's broken, when the end has come. <sighs> I just saw the end of uh, the last War of the Rings. I saw them all, and it's just wonderful when you when you experience something. People that read and read on a regular basis and go and search for stories and understand what I'm talking about. When you spend amount of time with characters in a story, and you feel so done after it you how you find the threat of an old life as it says in the movie it's just wonderful and i was just thinking like as the ship was sailing off if one day i make one person feel like that at the end of a journey that i tell i'm going to bed now good night